Dear viewers, the topic of my today's video is willpower. What is willpower? Willpower is a full blown mind body response. Willpower is full blown mind body response. Willpower is just like a muscle with the help of which we can achieve what we want. Why we need willpower? So that we can do the exercise regularly. We can, we can follow a diet. We could save money or we could quit bit bad habits like smoking, drinking, all these bad habits. And we can overcome procrastinations. Willpower is required if you want to achieve some goal which we have set. So it means willpower is must. What is the step of willpower? A step of well, uh, first step is we should resolve. When we make a resolution that we'll do walking daily, in the morning walk we'll do, I will do daily exercise, or we will control the food, we'll be through dieting, or certain goal we want to achieve, we are setting certain goal, these resolutions we are making. But tomorrow we may forget if we do not have willpower. But why then we are making the resolution? Resolution is being made under the pressure of dopamine and adrenaline. Because dopamine pathway is created because we want certain reward. So this dopamine pathway is What is the reward? That we should have good health. We should have enough wealth. We should have fame or we should have a success. So all these rewards in our mind, because of these rewards, dopamine activate us, activate our mind. And for that energy comes through the adrenaline. Now, today, in, under the pressure of dopamine and adrenaline, we are dissolving. But if we do not have the power tomorrow, we may not follow. We may not work for the resolution which we have made. Why? Because our mind, this may give certain temptations or we may have certain excuses. Oh, it's very cold. Oh, we want. We didn't want to get from uh, from the bed early because it's cold. It's a winter season. We'll start after some time. So then we will not start morning walk or we will not do the exercise because of all this. Or we do not. We may not be able to do the dieting because of these temptations. So it means the left brain. Say, I will do, I will, I will do this exercise. I will do dieting. But what the right brain, which is that I want power. I will, I will not like power. I will not power to do all these things. But we want power. Why? So this want power take us to willpower. But willpower, if we have, then these muscles which we have created by willpower, this activate our prefrontal cortex. And 
our ACC, singular cortex, anterior singular cortex. What we see in the brain, if you see, we are having motor neuron and the sensing neurons. And with this neurons, is, the neurons are connected in each and every part of the body. So with the help of willpower, we can give instructions to each and every organ to follow. Where the prefrontal cortex is located? It is located behind the forehead, this frontal cortex, and then behind that there is a prefrontal cortex. And this prefrontal cortex is responsible for decision making. For any pursuing anything because it is connected with the motor neurons. With the help of PFC, we can get the things done. And anterior singular cortex, this is the part of PFC because this is in the middle of the left brain and right brain. So this can, if this work properly, this can follow a path where we can take a correct decision. This helps in taking the decision making. So willpower actually forcing us to take action. By this, we are forcing ourselves, forcing yourself to take action. And what we should do to achieve the willpower. Because if willpower is not there and sometime in the overactivation of ACC also, our serotonin level gets reduced and we should have proper serotonin for that exercise is must. So if we do the exercise regularly, we do the meditation regularly, then our serotonin level also improves and we have proper willpower whatever you want for proper willpower if you feel sometime that you are losing willpower then let us examine ourselves and see that what we should do for improving the willpower See that you should set a small achievable goals. You should not make such goals which you cannot achieve. If you are resolving and then you are not achieving it, then you are then not you are pursuing to achieve the goal. That is of no use. So try setting a small achievable achievable goals and then focus so that we should achieve the goals. And also we should plan ahead and if there is a need, take help of others so that our goal is achieved. Third requirement is that we should avoid temptation. We should not be, suppose we are following a diet and then we are tempted seeing the good food. So, we should avoid temptation. Similarly, there should not be stress. We should try to avoid stress. And also, we should not criticize ourselves. Self-criticism is the worst thing. This reduces willpower. If we are criticizing ourselves, so oh, I am not able to do this thing. I am not able to do that thing. I am not a good person. Why to say? Try to improve. And when you have achieved a milestone, then reward yourself. That you, yes, you have achieved a goal. So you should celebrate it. 
if we regularly do like this then we can make the target for different things and we will be able to achieve see your prefrontal cortex it is meant to perform hard tasks these are the hard task master so in in pfc this acc which is in the middle of this right and left brain this helps us provided we try that our acc is not damaged if at all it is damaged then do the exercise exercise will improve it do meditation that will improve it but whatever resolution you make try to perform and achieve the goal which you have set thank you viewers if you like this video please subscribe